starting battlefield. I'm gonna guess based on how Seth against Wenbo went, but if he ends up on Dreamland, he'll switch to Sheik. But that's kind of hard against Sherry uh, in that matchup too. So, maybe not. Who knows? Uh, not a good situation for Mark there. He's caught in that little area where if he's just kind of like above stage and close to it, there's not much he can do. He has to get the ledge, but Fox can jump out and hit him. And or Fox can threaten to do that and then cover the ledge. If Mark tries to drop low, then he's stuck how he just was, but Terry will just hop and grab the ledge and be invincible. As I say that, Hap put a nice string on Jerry and trying to take the stock and catch himself up. Here's an opportunity right here. Yep, and that should do it. Up B. Finishes it off. So. Nice defense from Hat there. Getting back on stage. Uh, Alright, nice switch up too. Using the. Using the air dodge both times to get back to get back on, but one time going to ledge, one time going to stage. Show Jerry that he's not going to get easy reads off this. Nice regrab there from the side B, but then just doesn't follow up with a hit. Ah. Would have been better if he jumped off stage and did that. It covers really well, but if you just do it on stage, it's not. Not great, but even that's a Reed's commitment. So, as I'm saying this, Jerry uh, loses another stock. Hat up. But about now, Jerry will probably turn on the uh, afterburners if he's got them. All right, Hat gonna. Bring out his inner chic main, be comfortable by the ledge, be comfortable in the corner, not gonna worry about the fact that he's at high percent. You go for those uh cheesy old kills that you can get sometimes. The catch box. And from it, it doesn't quite get a kill, but it gives a lot of damage that leads to a finish up just like that. And all of a sudden had up three stacks of one against Jerry here is that the last time we saw this. Oh, that was a beautiful get up attack and ooh. Probably not a real thing. But Jerry just wasn't expecting it. He's caught with a down air after that get up attack knocks him off. Right, I think we're seeing the Marth. Probably going to Dreamland. Nope. Oh, going to FD. Jerry just confident. Jerry definitely one of the better Foxes on the stage uh, against Marth. So Fox is kind of corner on this stage because Marth can, um, once it, once Marth gets something started on him, he can't get out of the, oh, I'm sorry, I'm not right Once Marth gets started, something started on him, he has a hard time getting out of the corner, getting that spacing advantage. Um, but at the same time, he can, you know, do turn around lasers. And so as long as he is able to get free and isn't under corner pressure the whole time, um, he can do okay on the stage, and his crash cancel is really good. His down tilt pops Marth up, and once Marth's up, like he doesn't have great down hitboxes, kind of akin to Sheik. And Fox can just shark him with the up airs. It's, it's not as free as Sheik, uh, obviously. This match would be really bad still. So. Oh, and how might take him with him? But no, he doesn't. But he does get that bonus percentage. He's getting Jerry close that much closer to kill percent, and as I'm saying, Marth has a hard time getting down. Everybody has a hard time getting down against Marth. That disjoint of that sword just can make it impossible sometimes. Uh, but Jerry really well plays dash attacks. Uh, just spacing between past moves, some dash dancing into dash attack, and all of a sudden he's up. Nice in there. Uh, had the opportunity to finish it there and just didn't let it rip. There we go. 
So yeah, that covers a little bit lower than, uh, that cover? That might cover a little lower than Death Valley. I thought you had to be aerial, but it worked, so I don't know. Maybe it was just too high. Good job getting back to stage from Hat. Now he's chasing Jerry down. Got, got the space advantage. Quick reversal with that shine. Now he's dead. Yeah. Hey, you're not quite being patient enough. I think he needs to just eat a couple lasers and just wait for things to come on his terms a little bit more. Because he's getting hit with too many defensive nares that are just kind of like jump in, fade back nair. Uh, other spacing tools like that that he should just be able to run away from. But. Hey, right, so we're at 1 1 on not the stages you would expect for these guys to be one one on. I think we're going back. Yep. This makes sense. I mean, this is more strong stage in the matchup pretty easily. Hat probably knows what he did wrong. Or at least has some idea what to adjust, or else he would do something else. But as I say that, quick stock for Jerry. Uh, this is the chain grab. Getting a pretty good string here. Using those up tilts. But still doesn't really quite know knows the percents uh, that he needs to know to keep that going. Another quick shine leads to death. Hat wiping off his hands. Yeah, see, as soon as Jerry shoots a laser, Hat's gonna run in, and Jerry's just been calling him on it every time. Oh no. Bad situation, even if it's not stock here. A little reversal, but doesn't get much off it. See, that was better. He was weaving it out at that time. Things just get caught off guard by the fact that Jerry's losing. There we go, that's a stock. Alright, I just gotta feel good about that. You don't want to get four stock mid set, especially when you know when you take game one and know that you can beat him. Uh, yeah, uh, that's it. Here's what we'll see here. I'd like to see him honestly go cheek on Uh I know how it likes that stage. I know Jerry didn't for a long time. I think he's kind of over it now, but maybe Martha knew she's wouldn't be a bad pick either. Alright, or Fountain. Fountain, better choice, I guess. Still a small stage. It's a giant ceiling so you don't die from up smash quite so soon. Alright, good job Hat getting Ariel to get hit with that drill so that he uh, ends up getting a chance to act first. A little bit greedy on that up smash. I think it was pretty easy to react to for Jerry's part, uh, since he was already standing. But, you know, it's a good option. It's relatively safe. Ugh. Had a bad just, Oh! He's that little facial recovery. He was just high enough up, it looks like, to get active instantly. Or Jerry misses coverage, I'm not quite sure. Hatch gonna be very comfortable in the corner here, and this is what he did game one with uh, Marth, where he was just stayed in the corner until Jerry had to come to him basically because he's behind, and then racks up some damage, and you know he gets killed eventually. But 41% when you started out at 100 when Jerry respawned is pretty respectable. All right, Jerry waiting at the invincibility, but then quickly back on stage, not playing the same corner game that Hat was with Sheik. Uh, taking advantage of the fact that he's much lower percent and still can SDI and stuff, and really keeping Jerry in the corner here, not letting him out. Oh no. 
Those for a good option, but worked against a lot of players. But Jerry's just super ready for it. He's played way too many Sheiks. Most recently, yeah, I think he beat Swedish at Smash Valley at 3 2. Uh, not a Swedish had a great tournament, but still a good result. Top 20 player. Uh, those are kind of greedy needles there. Jerry's actually close enough. He could have punished, but uh, overreacts to them, I guess I'd call it. Like, got in the right direction and then just overshot on accident. Uh, right. Pat's playing well here, but he's got a. Got to be a little bit careful about some of these options he's picking, or Jerry's going to start catching on and punishing. This is looking better. Still being ag aggressive, but not being stupid about it. Oh no, accidental tournament went out, Chino Stall in this very bad spot now. So he'll probably be dead, but... Oh, not quite. Ah, misses the fast fall again. Oh, but he gets all three hits of the down smash, and this should be a dead Jerry. Yeah, that's it. Woo! Let's go, Pat! All right, somebody needs to go through the VODs of just the Xanadu and make Hat a combo video. He's had some really pretty stuff happening between this and the Wenbo set. All right, now we're going to Pokemon Save. Hat, I like things to say Sheik. I don't know. I don't like to say the Sheik, but I think it's good for better players who can use the... Extra speed you can get off the no impact lands, so not it's not gonna say it's a bad choice. But Jerry's starting out very strong. Hat turns around and uh, knows he's gonna miss the reaction, so he just shields. It's a quick narrow to shield. Attacks some damage on Jerry, but hard when you're down to stock and you have to chase down Fox like this. Jerry's gonna be content to run around and shoot some lasers, then pick his chip damage when he knows he's in a good position. It's the rough part about Sheik in this matchup once Fox is ahead on these longer stages. Jerry's very, very good at exploiting it. Uh, jumps right into that get up back. Uh, down two stacks again and not looking happy about it. Uh, it looks like we're going to wait out the transformation. Definitely. Good option for both players at this point. Adds down, he can't afford to take more damage. Fox gets a lot if he gets you on here. And Jerry just doesn't want to get cheesed and lose a stock for no reason. He can wait till neutral stage and just know that that's way less likely. Pat gonna practice that stalling right here. Maybe indicative of his options. Nope. Gets a full thing of needles and then goes right back into it. Does not go run a ledge or anything. Uh very sharking with these up airs, and they're working out really well. Good shine. How almost his second set of needles. We slowly miss bases, and Jerry takes the stock. Not looking good. Not looking good for the cheeks out there. Right. This should be stock. Shine isn't a real option. To stop needles off the ledge. Just get some needle off the ledge again. Uh, usually. Coverage. Uh, if you're too close and you take those needles, she can actually run off and hit you uh, while you're before you're really able to act out of this on. So good option to mix in occasionally, but That's it. Good games.